Well, I thought today I'd take you out to the Monastery Gethsemane, out in Bardstown, not far out from Louisville, and also to Loretto, where the nuns are. So there's a book you may have missed. This is called Hidden in the Same Mystery, Merton and Loretto. This beautifully illustrated book has many jewels, and it's done by, edited by um, Bonnie Thurston, who did the Merton and Sufism Journal, a great scholar. So I think you would love that. Now, as long as we're out at Gethsemane, uh, let's go to Merton's Hermitage. As you know, uh, Meatyard was a great friend of his and a photographer. So he took pictures of Merton, Merton hanging, picnicking with Wendell Berry. This is an entire book of pictures and captions from Merton's intimate journals. And this paints an extraordinary image of Thomas Merton and plus the introduction by Stephen Riley is really extraordinary. This is, this is a jewel. And then, as long as we're there, you know, um, Brother Paul Quenon was the uh, man who taped all of Merton's novice talks to the novices every single Sunday. And Paul himself is a poet and also a photographer. So Monk's Wear is a wonderful book showing his poems, but also photography of, of the monks and what they wear. And it's actually, it's actually funny. You know, it's actually funny. We, we really love this and we love Brother Paul. And then uh, while he was still Archbishop of Canterbury, um, uh, Father Patrick Hart gave uh, uh, Reverend, I guess he's now Father Rowan Williams, um, a manuscript task to do. And this is called A Silent Action. Thomas Merton by the Archbishop of Canterbury. This is a beautiful collection of essays. And then our very own Morgan Atkinson here in Louisville does these remarkable videos. Some are even shown out at the monastery. Here's one just on Gethsemane and all that goes on in the daily life. And a very, very beautiful one, Soul Searching, The Journey of Thomas Merton. So you know we do all of these Merton works and the annuals, but these are some of the little treasures that sort of get forgotten and slip through the cracks, and I hope you'll enjoy them very much.